Hi, I'm John. I'm the author of several publications on BERT, and I've been a BERT developer since its inception. I hope you find the following video informative and educational. BERT Chart DaVinci was designed to give developers quick and easy access to chart customizations and palettes that are eye-catching. With the Gallery plugin, a developer can browse the available styles and easily apply them to a chart in a BERT report. In this tutorial, I will demonstrate using the Chart DaVinci plugin for the BERT designer to apply customizations to a BERT chart. To start, download the BERT Chart DaVinci plugin from the BERT Exchange. Next, install the plugin. For more information on how to install plugins into BERT, follow the directions from the BERT tutorial video entitled Installing Plugins. With the BERT Chart DaVinci plugin installed, Go up to Window, Show View, Other, then go to BERT Chart DaVinci Gallery and select Chart DaVinci Gallery. The Chart DaVinci View provides a very convenient gallery of different custom chart formats that can be applied. With the report design open, browse through the gallery until a favorable customization is found. Once found, double-click on the image. A dialog will pop up with a list of charts in the report. A little tip, give each of these charts a unique name. This will make it easier to find within this dialog, and it is also good development practice. Select the chart from the list and hit OK. The plugin does a few things at this point. First, it creates a user variable at the report root and calls it Uses Chart DaVinci. This marks the report for the plugin to know not to initialize it a second time. It will also prepend the Chart DaVinci initialization script to the initialize event. Any script that you already have inside of the initialize event will be pushed down to the end of the Chart DaVinci initialization script. These two steps are only done the first time a developer applies Chart DaVinci to a report. The last thing that is done is apply the Chart DaVinci custom scripting to the chart itself. Select the chart and go to the Script tab. Customizations to the chart can be done by modifying this script. Instructions for how to modify certain elements is provided with the plugin. With this plugin, it now becomes very easy for developers to apply preset eye-catching visualizations to charts. If you found this tutorial useful, please visit birdexchange.org for more BERT developer tips.